Okay, it's time to harvest the corn. Whoa, they get they got knocked down by the wind, huh? Okay. Oh, I see a pepper here that was knocked down a little bit. Okay. It happens. At least it's time to harvest them. Okay, here's the corn. Oh yeah, it looks good. Wow, it looks nice. Good. Wow, nice. that's pretty. Wow, that is full too. Good job. Mm. That's gonna be tasty. Now my wife loves corn. She will eat five cobs of corn in one meal. <laughs> you know you will, Nellie. You love corn. Yeah. Wasn't there another cob on that one? Mm, good idea. It will give more um, more space for my peanuts to grow. Mm, okay, peanuts here. And my long beans. Those are peanuts. Good. Look at that. When, when the when the hairs look brown like that and the they're ready. Husks are turning brown. They're ready. Mm -hmm. True. And then you just pull one open, you can really see. Yeah. Wow, that is nice. Yeah. Hold it still. I'm not focusing on it, okay. That's a good one. That's re they're really filled. They're full too. Complete. You don't have a bunch of empty kernels. It's kind of interesting though. They look longer than they are. The husks are longer than the actual corn. Some of them are long like this one. They're actually kind of short. The husk looks longer. <laughs> Funny. Wow, you have a lot of good corn here now, now. Good job. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Maybe I can plant some more of my eggs up here. Baby eggs. Those small ones? Long bean. Some long bean. Yeah. Well, I don't want to step on the penis. Wow, those look good. Yeah. Those look like those are ready to be harvested too. You're not going to harvest them? No, I'm going to turn these into food. Oh, okay. A lot of corn here. 
you gonna harvest it all or just what you're gonna eat tonight? Mm. How long ago did you plant these? Check this out. This is big. Ah. Um, I think it was April. No, it was the end of March. Mm -hmm, okay. Like how white they are. That, that you know they're going to be sweet. That will be a sweet corn. Wow, look how full that is too. That is nice. Mm, smells so good. You got a lot more. Check out this pepper, wouldn't you? Keep getting it. That looks like a poblano. Somehow you got a poblano seed mixed in. Look at those, those are nice. Those are a very mild pepper, though. Oh, these are the jalapenos. They're not poblano. Okay. Mm. Here's some tomatoes over here. Huh? Picking a pepper, a sweet pepper. Okay, is that all the harvesting of the corn you're gonna do? Mm -hmm. the tomato not ready yet. Look at this tomato, it needs more trellis. Looks like it's getting bigger. Yeah. Those tomatoes are taller than you. Mm -hmm. I need to walk Got quite a nice to tomato garden going. Here's some bitter melon, really pretty, ube. You know it's a Filipino garden when you have bitter melon and ube in there. Right? And some cassava even. Cassava, drumstick, long beans, all signs of a Filipino garden. Not to mention a rose mixed in there too. Pretty rose. Look at that pretty rose. So nice. Okay. Well, that was fun harvesting that with you. Let's go cook them now. Here are some sweet pea tomatoes. I call them sweet pea because that's the size of them. They're the size of peas. Can you pick a couple and show them in your hand? Look at these. There they are. Look how pretty they are. Now these plants are massive. This, is, this garden is not filled with plants. These plants are only a few plants right here along the edge. And they've spread all the way out. Like over there, that's just, it, they grew that far that they're spread that far. There's no plants over there. They're all on this edge here. This is where they were planted and they've just spread like crazy. It's, it's incredible. And they are sweet. These tomatoes are so sweet. Now these things are going to be covered with them. They, they almost look like a weed. There's a bird that's nesting there. A bird? Wow, cool. Yep. We got these seeds free from Baker Creek Heirloom Seed. I didn't even buy them. They just got them for free and my wife planted them and wow, 
they are growing really good. Pretty amazing. This little compost pile I'm making here. Look at these. Cucumber. These are tasty too. Peel the skin and put them in some vinegar. Very good. This simple bamboo trellis here. Just stuck some bamboo in the ground. The rest of this is my sunflower garden. She just put, found a spot in my garden and planted her cucumber in my garden. Yeah, they're growing great. I'm pretty much the one that waters them. <laughs> Just a little corner here. Look at all the flowers on them. There's going to be a lot more cucumber, and we've already eaten a lot of them. How many do you think you picked off of here so far? More than 10? Mm -hmm. They look good. I wish. Here are some parsnip I planted here, transplanted here. I did a video. Look at them. I think they're huge. And my purple beans. Wow, all these parsnip are growing good. Well, we got some pep, some purple beans. Look at that. Getting some good ones here. There's some eggplant. Uh oh, that eggplant's getting a little wilted too. And there's parsnip mixed in here. They look like celery. Hmm. Crazy. I can't wait to see a parsnip eventually. Plants are going to do okay. And there's a bunch of squash growing out of this garden too. I didn't plant them, they just grew in the compost. I had compost in here. And the squash just grew out of that.
Pretty nice. These purple beans have really pretty flowers too. A nice looking plant. But when you cook them, the beans turn green. Pretty good. Uh oh, is that are the eggplants getting wilted again? Squash. Pretty nice little raised garden. These are yam leaf. I can't believe how much. Dude, this is already huge. This is like middle of the summer big. These have been growing over here for years. They just love her garden. So you're picking some yam leaf, Nellie? Yep. What do you look for when you pick them? They all look the same to me. Excuse me? And the, the tender part. And you can tell that by looking at it or by touching it? Oh, I just know. From look or touch? Look. Huh? Look. Okay. Do you think you have enough to fill that bowl? Oh, yeah. I can see this is not all yam leaf. There's something over here you were calling this okra. I see one of those things you were telling me were okra, Nelly. Can you show me a couple of those too, maybe? That's what you call the okra, right? Mm. <clears throat> hmm, like a milk comes out of them, huh? Mm -hmm. So the deer are not getting at these at all. All the ones that are picked are ones that you picked. Oh, the deer eat everything. The deer have been getting at them? Did the person you gave that winter grain to, did they like it? Yeah. Is that all you're picking for now? She picked one green leaf, but not the other. She knows there's a difference. Mm. 
you can hear them just snap right off. If they're not good, they don't snap off very easy, huh? Is that one of the ways you can tell? Yeah. If you grab it and it's kind of tough? Because when they're tender, they just snap off easy. Okay, do you want to look at these okra here now? Yeah. Whoa, there's a bunch of bigger ones on the bottom. Well, this, oh, the buds. Like this, the bud. There's one right there. Okay. Okay, I'll pull that back. Hmm. Oh, look at that one. You gonna pick any of them so I can no. see it? Oh, no. Why not? They're not ready? No, you gotta make them. They look kind of big. Do they get a lot bigger than that? They do look like okra. Now I'm seeing how they are okra. You don't eat those though. Oh, you don't eat them? You only eat the leaf. Oh, you don't eat the okra. Mm -hmm. Okay. Can you try getting a little closer on some of the okra? Does that look like an okra? Not really. If I was at, say like right from the start, I'd be like, no, that's not an okra. <laughs> okay. We're gonna have tons of those seeds now. They're called chipotle. Tomatoes, I had a tomato with my dinner last night. So good, juicy and sweet. You know a lot of stuff. <laughs> 